Hi, this is Lisa. And Yolanda. I have to show you the um the little chest that Yolanda gave me. Um, and some of the goodies that I have inside. Some of the things I've showed you. And um I have a few other things. Like some of the things you may remember, like <laughs> my nest. <laughs> you remember the nest? <laughs> okay. These are some things and there's no order that Yolanda made for me that I keep in my box. Yay. Little flowers she's given me with cards. And this, wait a minute, this flower was made from? The Liquitex Super Gel. Oh, yeah. It's kind of squishy. And sometimes I, it's like a worry flower. And I like play with it a little bit there. <laughs> but oh. um, I have some cards, which I won't show. Well, I'll show. And peek at the inside. And little notes from her. Some thing, other things that she made me. But the newest additions to, my, to this little chest is um, the ATCs. Oh, let me save that one for later. Um, this one she made for me. Yay. Yay. <laughs> and she signed in the back. I love that one. I love all of them. I have favorites though. And this one. Let's go wild. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> and this one here. Tell everybody what this is. Oh, that's one of my favorites. That's some of Lisa's artwork, believe it or not. An no. accidental artwork. Yes. <laughs> Whenever she paints, she has uh, paper underneath her major project. So what I did was I snitched some of the paper from her when she wasn't looking. Mm -hmm. And I cut it up and made a mosaic picture myself. She made away with it. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah, and this is like, it. this is actually black paint that I had underneath one of the um, 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 background layouts I was doing. It's like, this is my scrap paper. And she yeah. recycled. Mm -hmm. And not only that, she said, what are you doing with that? And, get, and I said, you will say. Yeah. <laughs> was she surprised? Yeah. Okay, there's those. And then here is another one. Mm-hmm. Yay. Yay. Where did we get this from? That one? Oh gosh, I don't know where we got that piece from. But I know the the cardboard was That's something pretty. that um I think we had on hand. Yeah. And this is and, nice. and I just ripped it up and put it on there. A few layers on there. She got some skills, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> she got skills. She got <laughs> mad skills. Hey, this one. This one's so cute. That's it's it's cool. almost like you're there. Yeah, it's a mini mini ATC. Yeah. Because I made that, I actually made that more of a 3D ATC. Is this some of my leftover, is this some of my leftover paper Yeah, it is. Paper that down here. the same black and white paper that you had. And if you look, there. it looks like it may be stone or something down uh -huh. there. How cute is that? I was trying to make it like a beach effect where the blue uh, encaustic wax was in the background and then and the brown like the was sun. the sand and that the flower was a, a prima flower that I used for a sun. Where did this come? Is that part of a fence? Yeah, that's part of a fence. Yeah. And, and then, of course, the, the birdie came from a Sizzix dot. I mean, that's a Sizzix oh, spellbinder. Oh, yeah. There you go. Yay. Yay. Okay, let's see. I have that, and then these three pieces. All in caustic wax. And that one, one on the piece. right was done with a small too iron. Close, too close. Uh, yeah. It's a technique that I'll be showing yeah. shortly. Okay, let me do this. Let's do better. One at a time. There we go. Yeah, that one's an in caustic wax. And this one. That one's another encaustic wax technique. I was just playing around that day with both of those. Well, of course, I get to get that. And that first. one, I wanted to do it. I just love. Nice. I just love the, the fact. It reminded me of, of Sandy Brown walls. Let's see how much time I got left. Okay, I'm going to show. Oh, and and um, this. Wait a minute. Oh, this is from Darlene. Yay. She made it for both of us. I want to show it now. She gave it to us. Yay! Oh, and this is a little. Tuck spot. Yeah. I don't know if I showed this before. I wasn't sure, so I showed it again. She doesn't do ATCs, but she gave us one. <laughs> it was so special. So, I'll put that there. How much time do I have? Okay. I will show this really, really quick, guys. This is another one of the um, soapbox books that I made. And this is going to, from a friend of my mom's. I can't remember if I showed you, but oh, it's going to flip real quick. Plenty of room for journaling. 
and some stamping. I did some coloring in this one for her. Let me see. There we go. Okay. I can't remember if I showed this one. I wasn't sure. But I'm going to show it. <laughs> it's a cute one. There we go. But yeah, and it has um, seven signatures in it. And bound it with um, thread. Here, oh, if you can see it there. The thread and beads in the back, just like the last one I did. Um, how much time do I have? Uh, no, that's about it, I think. Um, yeah, but this is the chest that I keep on, on, on the night table. And these are the things, some of the things that Yolanda gave me. That I keep in here. Oh, along with my um, chipboard pieces that she gave me. These stay in here too. But I know I showed these. So. And they stay in the box too. Okay. Thanks everybody for watching. Thanks. Bye. Bye.